Good morning, year one. Here we are ready for Thursday's phonics, all right? So you need your board and you need a pen, all right? Ready to start, probably need a cloth just to wipe some bits off as well on the board when we're going. So today, as it's getting towards the end of my week with you, what I thought is not a, not a treat, it's just like a different kind of thing to do in phonics. So what I thought we'd think about is our alphabet, first of all, just to notice two different types of letter in the alphabet. So what I would like you to start doing is writing the alphabet on your board. You ready? You, again, you can use mine. You should know the alphabet, but you can use mine as well if you want to. The only difference being when we say the alphabet, we don't use our phonics. We don't go... A, B, K, D, F, do we? We say the letter names, so we say A, B, C, D. All right, so here we go. Let's put them in alphabetical order. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. There you go. All right, so just pause me for a minute so you can get your alphabet written on your board. Okay, so hopefully you've got the alphabet written on your boards now. Okay, now what we're going to do, we're going to have a look at our alphabet and we're going to put a circle around some of the letters. So I'd like a circle around A, first of all. You put a circle around A for me? Brilliant. I would like a circle around E. All right, so you can see which ones I'm putting a circle around. Uh, put a circle around I. You see it? Just here. All right. Put a circle around O. That looks like a donut now, doesn't it? And put a circle around U. All right. So we've got a circle around A. We've got a circle around E. We've got a circle around I. We've got a circle around O. And we've got a circle around U. All right. A E I O U. So. The letters that we've put a circle around, all of those letters, and here's a new word for you, all of those blah, 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 all of those circled letters are called vowels. Can you say vowels? Everybody say vowels. Say vowels. Thank you. So vowels are A, E, I, O, U. Five vowels, all right? All of the letters without a circle around it, like B, C, D, F, G, H, J, K, L, M, yeah, G, H, J, K, L, M, N, P, Q, R, S, T, V, W, X, Y, and Z, they are all consonants. Can you say consonants? I sound like Dora the Explorer. You say consonants. Can you say consonants? That's it. So all of the ones without circles are consonants. All of the ones with circles are vowels. There is a sneaky one. This little Herbert here. This one can be both. Sometimes as a consonant, sometimes he sneaks in as a vowel. So yeah, so there are both, or he can be both things. So circles are vowels, not circles are consonants. This one is both. Hmm. He's a sneaky spy, this one. Right, okay. Now, what I would like you to think about now is just um if we if we, let's take out all of let's take out all of our vowels first of all. Okay, so I'm gonna take out all of these vowels, every single one of them. I'm even gonna take out my sneaky spy vowel. Alright, so we're just left with the pure consonants. Alright, there you go. So I've rubbed out I've rubbed out A, I've rubbed out E, I've rubbed out I, I've rubbed out O, I've rubbed out U, and I've rubbed out Y as well. Now, if we tried to use these letters here to make a word, we couldn't make a word. You can't make a word without a vowel. This one, like I said, this one sometimes is a bit of a sneaky one, Y, and so sometimes you can make a word using Y, but just these ones, just the pure consonants, you can't build a word with just pure consonants, all right? You just, you can't do it. So, um, make, 
some people say you can make Mr. and Mrs. They're shortened words. They're abbreviations. They are. All right. But what I'm trying to say is that vowels are really, really important in our language. Okay. So let's just rub our boards clear. Now we know which are vowels, which ones are consonants. Right. I've got a clear board. Now, if I put C, that means consonant. And if I put V, that means vowel. All right. Today, the words that we're going to be using are going to be consonant, vowel, consonant, consonant words. C, V, C, C. All right. They're the kind of words that we're going to build. So let me give you an example of a C, V, C, C word. And let me clear some space again. I'll do that as my title. Consonant, vowel, consonant, consonant. So there's a consonant, there's a vowel, there's a consonant, there's a consonant. So let's see if we can read what this CVCC word says. T, E, N, T, T, E, N, T, Tent. All right. So consonant, vowel, consonant, consonant. See that? I'll stop saying all those words now because that might be a little bit confusing. We'll just get on with the spellings. The next word is going to be this one. There it is again. All right, let's see if we can sound it. B and B and bend, isn't it? All right, uh, let's see if we can use a different. Let's try this one. Let's put our sound buttons underneath. P and pond, where the ducks live. Uh, maybe we could do this one. Est, t, est, test. All right. Now, using our CVCC knowledge, what I'd like you to do to test your skills, could you go on to Spelling Shed? All right. I've set up a list on there and it's called, um, it's called Thursday CVCC. All right. So have a look on Spelling Shed and then have a go at doing those spellings. I can look on my computer and I can see exactly who's doing it. So I know which one of you has been on it today. I know which one of you has been on it all week, but I know also which ones haven't been looking on there. So please get on there and have a go on Spelling Shed. If you don't have your login details, get in touch with your class teachers and then they can give you your, um, your passwords. All right? Okay. All right. I'll see you tomorrow for phonics. I'll see you in a little while for some handwriting.